welcome to home school this is your class 7 mathematics ncrt or cbsc board we are in our chapter 4 simple equations and your exercise 4.2 first main what's your main heading give first the step you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation already we have seen this type of problems in your introduction part let's turn here a first sub question x minus 1 equal to 0 what is the condition first the step you will choose to separate the variable we need to just separate the variable and then solve find the value of variable x minus 1 equal to 0 other than variable first step identify the value what do you have minus 1 Minus 1 opposite. What is that? Plus 1. Right here. Add. Add 1 on both sides. Add 1 on both sides means left hand side and right hand side. X minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 0 plus 1. Minus 1 plus 1 will be cancelled x is equal to 0 plus 1, 1 is your answer. This is the way we need to find the value of the variable. This is the way you need to give first step to separate the variable and then solving the equation. Similarly, b, x plus 1 equal to 0. Other than variable, what you need to observe? Plus 1. Plus 1 opposite is minus 1. Minus means subtract, subtract 1 on both sides. x plus 1 minus 1 equal to 0 minus 1. Plus 1 minus 1 will be cancelled. x is equal to 0 minus 1 will be minus 1. Right? Are you able to follow children? See the third one, x minus 1 is equal to 5. Other than variable identify here, minus 1 you have. Minus 1 opposite is plus 1. Plus 1 means add 1 on both sides. Add 1 on both sides, left hand side and right hand side. x minus 1 plus 1 is equal to 5 plus 1. Minus 1 plus 1 will be cancelled. X is equal to 5 plus 1 will be 6. Children, if you are able to follow these three problems, pause the video and try to solve remaining problems and then play video and check your answers. Okay? See the D option, X plus 6 equal to 2. Other than variable, what do you have? Plus 6. Plus 6 opposite, minus 6. Minus means subtract, subtract 6 on both sides. Subtract 6 on both sides. X plus 6 minus 6 is equal to 2 minus 6. Plus 6 minus 6 cancel. 6 minus 6 0 or you can cancel. Any way you can do. 2 minus 6. In 2 you can subtract 6? No. What is the value that? It will be take a negative sign. 2 minus 6 will be minus 4. E. Y minus 4 equal to minus 7. Other than variable you have minus 4. Minus 4 opposite plus 4. Right here. Add 4 on both sides. y minus 4 plus 4 is equal to minus 7 plus 4. Minus 4 plus 4 cancel. y is equal to minus 7 plus 4. It will be minus 3. What is the y value? Minus 3. f sub question y minus 4 equal to 4. Other than variable you have minus 4. Minus 4 opposite plus 4. Add 4 on both sides. Add 4 on both sides. 
y minus 4 plus 4 is equal to 4 plus 4. Minus 4 plus 4 cancel. y is equal to 4 plus 4, 8. g, y plus 4 is equal to 4. Other than variable, you can see plus 4. Plus 4 opposite, minus 4. Minus 4 means subtract. Subtract 4 on both sides. Y plus 4 minus 4 is equal to 4 minus 4. Plus 4 minus 4 cancel. And here also if you want you can cancel. Then what it is left? Y equal to 0. H. Y plus 4 is equal to minus 4. Other than variable you can see plus 4. Plus 4 opposite is minus 4. That means subtract 4 on both sides. 4 on both sides. Y plus 4 minus 4 is equal to minus 4 minus 4. Plus 4 minus 4 cancel. Y is equal to what is minus 4 minus 4? If you have both negative, take negative sign and add the numbers 4 plus 4 will be 8. This is the way we need to find the values of the variable. Second main, give first the step you will use to separate the variable and then solve the equation. How we have done here first mean similarly we need to do this mean but in this mean we have the variables followed with the multiplication or division. If you have a multiplication it's opposite division. If you have a variable followed with the division it's opposite is multiplication. See the first problem. The first sub question A 3L is equal to 42. Observe the variable L is the variable and the number followed with the variable where it is and how it is 3 into L multiplied that number is multiplied so divide with the same number divide with what we need to divide what number it is multiplied with that number we need to divide divide 3 on both sides. 3L by 3 is equal to 42 by 3. 3, 3 cancel. 3, 1, sir, also you can write. And this one, 3, 1, sir, 3, 1 is left. 1 and 2, 12. 3, 4, sir, 12. It implies L is equal to 14. 14 is your answer. Separate the variable. And then solve the equation. L is equal to 14. Second, B option. B by 2 equal to 6. Your variable is B. Followed with the number. Where is that number? Number is divided. Divided means it's opposite multiple. What number is divided? With that number, multiply on both sides. Multiply. 2 on both sides. B by 2 into 2 is equal to 6 into 2. 2 1 sa. You are left with B is equal to 6 2 sa. 12. B is equal to 12. C option P by 7 is equal to 4. Variable a number is divided for that variable. Division opposite multiplication. Multiply 7 on both sides. What's the number divided children? 7. So with that number only multiply. P by 7 into 7 is equal to 4 into 7. This 7, this 7 cancels. P is equal to 7 fourths. 28 is your answer. D option 4x is equal to 25. Variable is x. 
फोर इज मल्टीप्लाइड मल्टीप्लीकेशन ऑपोजिट डिविजन सो डिवाइड डिवाइड फोर ऑन बोथ साइड फोर एक्स बाई फोर इज इक्वल टू ट्वेंटी फाइव बाई फोर दिस फोर दिस वन सा कैंसल x is equal to twenty five by four is your answer, right? Next one, E option. Eight y is equal to thirty six. Y is a variable. A number is multiplied. So divide with that number. Divide eight on both sides. Eight y by eight is equal to thirty-six by eight. Eight ones are cancel. Do you get an eight table thirty-six? No. If you want, you can simplify this. Two fours are eight. Two eighteen sa. Two ones are two. One is left. One and sixteen. What happens to eight sa? Sixteen. If you want, you can cancel this. Two two sa four. Two nines are eighteen. What you are left with implies y is equal to nine by two, right? F option z by three is equal to five by four. Your variable is z, and it is followed with a dividing with a number. So with that number, you need to multiply. Multiply three on. Both sides. Z by three into three is equal to five by four into three. This three, this three cancel. Z is equal to five three sa fifteen by four is your answer. Option G. A by five is equal to seven by fifteen. A is the variable. And a number is divided. Divided means you need to multiply with that number on both sides. Multiply five on both sides. A by five into five is equal to seven by fifteen into five. Five and five will be cancelled. And here also you can cancel five ones, five threes. A is equal to seven by three is your answer. Last sub question H. Twenty t is equal to minus ten. Observe the variable. Variable is t. A number is multiplied for the variable. So we need to divide. Divide. Divide twenty on both sides. Twenty t by twenty is equal to minus ten by twenty. Zero zero cancel. Twenty twenty cancel. T is equal to minus one by two is your answer. Observe carefully. Understand first all problems, and then do once in your bath notes. Right? Practice carefully. This is all very easy. Okay. With this, we are going to end our session today. In our next session, we are going to complete this exercise. Until that, keep watching, children. Thank you all.